Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into the top places to visit in Japan and weighing their pros and cons. Whether you're planning your first trip or your 10th, this guide will help you make the most of your journey. Japan is a country of incredible diversity, from the neon-lit streets of Tokyo to the serene temples of Kyoto. Each region offers a unique blend of tradition and modernity, nature and urban excitement. So grab your chopsticks and get ready to explore the land of the rising sun as we break down the best destinations and help you decide which ones to add to your must-visit list. Alright, let's kick things off with Tokyo, the vibrant capital of Japan. Tokyo is one of those cities that truly has something for everyone. First up, the food. Oh, the food! From Michelin-starred sushi restaurants to bustling street food stalls serving up steaming bowls of ramen, your taste buds are in for a real treat. You could spend your entire trip just eating your way through Tokyo and still only scratch the surface of its culinary scene. And then there's the shopping. Whether you're after high-end fashion in Ginza, quirky souvenirs in Harajuku, or electronics galore in Akihabara, Tokyo's shopping scene is an experience in itself. Prepare to be amazed by the sheer variety and quality of goods on offer. But it's not all about modern delights in Tokyo. You've got incredible historical sites like the Sensoji Temple, a magnificent Buddhist temple dating back to the 7th century, and the Meiji Shrine, a peaceful oasis dedicated to Emperor Meiji and Empress Shokin. Now let's talk about the potential downsides. Tokyo is a massive city, and with that comes crowds, especially during peak seasons. Be prepared to navigate through throngs of people, particularly in popular areas like Shibuya Crossing and the Tsukiji Fish Market. The cost of living in Tokyo can also be quite high, especially when it comes to accommodation and transportation. It's worth doing your research and budgeting accordingly, especially if you're on a tight budget. Another thing to consider is the language barrier. While English is spoken in some tourist areas, don't expect everyone to be fluent. Brushing up on some basic Japanese phrases will go a long way in enhancing your experience and connecting with the locals. But honestly, despite these minor drawbacks, Tokyo is an incredible city that will leave you breathless. The energy, the culture, the food, it's an experience you won't soon forget. Just remember to pace yourself, plan your itinerary in advance, and embrace the organized chaos that is Tokyo. Trust me, it's all part of the adventure. Next up, we're traveling to Kyoto, the ancient capital of Japan and a city steeped in history, culture, and tradition. If you're looking to experience the heart and soul of traditional Japan, Kyoto is the place to be. Kyoto is home to countless temples, shrines, and gardens, each more beautiful and awe-inspiring than the last. You can easily lose yourself wandering through the serene bamboo forest at Arashiyama, marveling at the golden Kinkakuji Temple, or finding inner peace at the Fushimiyanari Shrine with its thousands of vermilion tori gates. One of the things I love most about Kyoto is the opportunity to immerse yourself in traditional Japanese culture. You can witness the elegance of a tea ceremony, try on a beautiful kimono, or even stay in a traditional ryokan, a Japanese inn with tatami mats and sliding doors. Kyoto is also a food lover's paradise, known for its delicate flavors and refined presentation. Be sure to try some local specialties like vegetarian shojin ryori cuisine, matcha sweets, and of course, authentic Kyoto-style ramen. Now let's address the potential downsides. Kyoto's popularity as a tourist destination means that it can get crowded, especially during peak seasons like spring for the cherry blossoms and autumn for the fall foliage. Prices for accommodation and tours can also skyrocket during these times, so it's essential to book well in advance if you plan to visit during these periods. To avoid the crowds, consider visiting during the shoulder seasons or exploring some of the lesser-known temples and gardens. You'll be rewarded with a more tranquil and authentic experience. Overall, Kyoto is a magical city that offers a glimpse into Japan's rich history and cultural heritage. It's a place where you can slow down, appreciate the beauty around you, and connect with the spirit of ancient Japan. Just remember to plan your trip carefully, be prepared for crowds, and embrace the slower pace of life in this enchanting city. Chapter 3. Osaka, the nation's kitchen. Get ready to indulge your taste buds because we're heading to Osaka, Japan's second largest city, and a street food lover's paradise. Osaka is known for its lively atmosphere, down-to-earth locals, and of course its incredible food scene. Osaka is often referred to as the nation's kitchen for a good reason. This city takes its food seriously, and you'll find an astounding array of culinary delights. 
From savory okonomiyaki pancakes and deep-fried takoyaki octopus balls to fresh seafood and hearty kushikatsu skewers. One of the best things to do in Osaka is to wander through the Dotonbori district, a vibrant entertainment area with dazzling lights, giant billboards, and street food stalls lining the canal. It's a feast for the senses and a great place to soak up the city's energetic vibe. But Osaka is more than just food. You can also explore Osaka Castle, a stunning landmark that played a significant role in Japanese history, or visit the Osaka Aquarium Kaiyukan, one of the largest aquariums in the world, home to whale sharks, giant spider crabs, and other fascinating marine life. Osaka is also a great base for exploring the surrounding Kansai region, including cities like Nara, Kobe, and even a day trip to Kyoto. Now let's talk about the potential downsides. Osaka is a bustling metropolis and while it has a unique charm, it might not be the best choice for those seeking a traditional Japanese experience like Kyoto. The city is also known for its humid summers and chilly winters, so be sure to pack accordingly depending on when you visit. However, Osaka's friendly locals, delicious food and lively atmosphere make it a must-visit destination in Japan. It's a city that will captivate your senses, fill your belly, and leave you with a smile on your face. Don't be afraid to embrace the city's energetic spirit, try all the street food you can handle, and get ready for an unforgettable adventure in Osaka. Chapter 4 Hiroshima, a city of peace and resilience. Our journey takes us now to Hiroshima, a city forever etched in history and a testament to the resilience of the human spirit. Visiting Hiroshima is a powerful and moving experience offering a chance to reflect on the past and learn about the importance of peace. The Hiroshima Peace Memorial Park is a must-visit, serving as a poignant reminder of the devastation caused by the atomic bomb and a symbol of hope for a peaceful future. The park features several memorials including the atomic bomb dome, the only structure left standing near the hypocenter of the blast. While the historical significance of Hiroshima is undeniable, the city also offers a surprising amount to see and do. You can explore Shukeian Garden, a beautiful traditional garden designed to represent various landscapes in miniature, or take a ferry to Miyajima Island, home to the iconic floating Tori Gate of Itsukushima Shrine. Hiroshima is also known for its delicious local cuisine, including Hiroshima-style okonomiyaki, which features layers of noodles and a thinner batter than its Osaka counterpart. Be sure to try some local oysters too, as Hiroshima Bay is famous for its oyster cultivation. Now it's important to acknowledge that visiting Hiroshima can be emotionally challenging. The weight of history is palpable, and it's essential to approach your visit with respect and sensitivity. Additionally, while Hiroshima has a vibrant downtown area, its nightlife might not be as lively as other major cities in Japan. However, the opportunity to learn about history, pay your respects, and experience the resilience of this remarkable city makes Hiroshima a truly unforgettable destination. It's a place that will stay with you long after you leave. Remember to allow ample time to explore the Peace Memorial Park, engage with the exhibits and stories shared there, and reflect on the importance of peace in our world. Chapter 5. Hokkaido Japan's Wild and Wonderful North Get ready to embrace the great outdoors because we're heading north to Hokkaido, Japan's northernmost island, known for its stunning natural beauty, fresh seafood, and outdoor adventures. If you're a nature enthusiast or seeking a different side of Japan, Hokkaido is calling your name. Hokkaido is a paradise for outdoor enthusiasts, offering world-class skiing and snowboarding in the winter, breathtaking lavender fields in the summer, and hiking trails through pristine national parks year-round. One of Hokkaido's most famous attractions is the Shiratoko Peninsula, a UNESCO World Heritage Site known for its untouched wilderness and abundant wildlife. You can take boat tours to observe the peninsula's dramatic coastline or go birdwatching. Another must-visit is Bie, a picturesque town famous for its rolling hills and stunning seasonal colors. Rent a bicycle and explore the area at your own pace, stopping to admire the views and take photos of the iconic lone trees. No trip to Hokkaido is complete without indulging in its culinary delights. Hokkaido is renowned for its fresh seafood, including succulent crab and juicy scallops. Hokkaido's northern location means it experiences colder temperatures than the rest of Japan, especially during winter. Hokkaido is also less accessible than other major cities in Japan, requiring flights or longer train rides. Overall, Hokkaido offers a refreshing change of pace from the hustle and bustle of Japan's main island. 
It's a place to reconnect with nature, savor fresh local produce, and experience a different side of Japanese culture. Embrace the tranquility of Japan's wild and wonderful north. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more travel tips and guides. Let us know in the comments which place in Japan you're most excited to visit. From the bright lights of Tokyo to the ancient temples of Kyoto, the delicious street food of Osaka, the historical significance of Hiroshima, and the breathtaking landscapes of Hokkaido, Japan has something to offer every type of traveler. We hope this video has helped you narrow down your choices and sparked your wanderlust for the land of the rising sun. Start planning your dream trip today.